All right, so dirt face got a nice map as well. This map's not too bad. Nice small map. Okay, there's someone working on that though. Gonna reveal us. I guess we can chase. We got time. Of course we got time. It's the start of the game. All right, let's see what the movement is like. Decide if we want to continue the chase. I feel like she made a lot of distance there. Was that live? Door's already broken, so we can just go around. To be honest, though, I'm not even sure how much quicker than just vaulting that is. I think it is quicker, though. Gonna camp that, and then down she goes. Devour kind of in a good spot. Yeah, the totem spawns on this map are really good. Totems are really difficult to find on this map for the survivors. Which, I guess for um, for Devour, that's good. For Plaything, it's not so good, though. Although, with Plaything, they'll find them easy anyway, because they get to see the auras. Did get revealed there again. Sprint Burst, that explains why she stayed on the gem for so long. Gonna play Window there. Might get God Palette. Do get God Palette, nice. Did lose a gem, but that's fine. We're doing pretty well. Took out God Palette there. Going in for the save. No, we need to move away, actually, for Devour. Let them get the save. And then stealth. And see if we can get the down on the person who saved. I think the rock's in the way. Yeah, they revealed us there. Wow, what is this gen speed? Alright, well, this calls for tunneling. <laughs> what is this gen speed? That is crazy. How... How did that even happen? How has three gens popped? Good fake there. Now she is dead, though. Need to watch out for the pallet save. Wait, in fact, I don't even think she's in the pallet now. She's on the edge of it. Yeah, she's not. Take a nice M1 there as well. Gen speed is crazy, this game. Now we're going straight back. Could have taken M1 there, but I have no interest in that. We want the Nia out of the game. Want the Nia out of the game, then we want the Devour. Little sus on the gen speed. Yeah, it seems it, doesn't it? It seems a bit suspect. She's actually going to go down for the other girl. All right, I guess we'll take that. I guess we'll take that. Because next hook, uh, or next unhook is the Devour. But yeah, that actually did seem a little bit suspect. That seemed a little bit too quick, didn't it? I mean, maybe brand new parts or something, though. Who knows? This one's almost done as well. We've not used our power much, but it doesn't really matter. We're about to get another stack of Devour. Was really fast. Yeah, we'll have a look what they had at the end. Maybe two brand new parts. Prove thyself, something like that. Who knows? But we've got the near here. There's the down. All right, two of them on death hook, unless there's DS. No DS, so two people on death hook. All right, we recovered well. We're about to get a Pentimento stack here as well. Yeah, that chance speed is crazy. I don't think they're hacking, though. I don't think it's abnormal, at least. Did get the save there, which is a little bit unfortunate. We don't get another stack. Looks like this Nia's all but gave up, I think. All right, she's going to take it down. Oh, wait. What was that Devour? I thought Devour was that one over there. I guess they took out Devour then. I thought Devour was the one in main, right? Yeah, obviously not. It wasn't then. That must have been a plaything. Okay, I assume that one's plaything. Claudette's gonna try coming for the flashy save. We're gonna get a quick that nice down here. It's in the tiny hut. Yeah, I think so. It must have been. But I thought it was the one over there. Because I remember checking at the start of the game. I guess we checked at the, I guess I checked at the start though when Plaything was already up. And that's what it was. I think that one's Plaything. We need to be very careful here. This chance speed has been crazy though. I actually want to start here and then get a 99. She is right there. Exposer. I think we made that right. Yeah, we definitely do. What was that? Off the record. That explains why she was so confident then. Alright, we need one of the guys that's dead and hook. Gonna try and take a hit there. Nia's dead and hook. We'll just take the two M1s, get her out of the game. How? Yeah, I think it was off the record, but was that 80 seconds? Something's not going something's not right here, is it? What was that? Metal. Nah, this seems sus at this point. This one wasn't off the record, for sure it wasn't, because she, she got hooked a long time ago. BT wasn't BT, she's the one who unhooked, not the um, the other girl was the one that got saved. I don't know, we'll have a look what they brought at the end of the game, though. 
All right, the other knee has dead and hook as well, right? We've not used much of our power at all. We've only got the one insta down. Even the insta down we didn't get because of off the record, actually. <laughs> We're going to stealth here. Come around. Went back. There she is. Down she goes. Jolt on the gen as well. And now she's dead and hooked. So I think we've done a successful comeback here. Really good comeback. That gen speed was crazy. That was phenomenal gen speed. Can do a quick dead hard. Some yeah, I mean, maybe, but... I don't know. That that seems strange. I'm not sure what they had. We'll have a look at the end, though. I don't think they was hacking. We'll have a look. Other girls on the other gen. Get her exposed. What we should do here... Uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's make a paranoid. Let's get the other girl exposed, and then let's chase this girl. Did she go back to the gen? If she did, we'll go back for her. Yeah, she did go back to the gen. Let's go back for her, then. She's still got halfway left on the timer. Over halfway, in fact. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Now she'll volley it. Yeah, if she had endurance there, that would have definitely been dodgy, but no endurance there. Ada was so sure she could loop. Yeah, she seemed very confident up there. <laughs> I don't know why she seemed so confident, because that's really not a good loop at all. <laughs> very good comeback. Yeah, we did well there. I'm, I'm pretty pleased with this. She went up there. She's going to drop down. I think she's waiting up there for us. No, it did move down. This Claudette is very good. No sign of Hatch nearby, though. Unless it's over here somewhere. She gets one more vault. Now it's blocked. Now pretty much out of options, I think. She might have a pallet here. Yeah, it does have a pallet, though. Gonna move away from that. And now we've got her. She's played very well, though. She's done really well, though. Down she goes, though. Hello. All right, I, I actually didn't want to like, fully stalk her. It would have been better to leave a 99, I think. We're going to come in with a vault here. Ram back, I think. Yeah, ram back. Did go for the vault there. Going to move away as well. Is that live? That's live. God pallet on the other side. We're getting a couple of god pallets down at the very least, but I don't think we're getting it down here. Going to go for the blind. Oh, we're not making it. We're not making it. All right, we'll chase the Jeff, though. All right, that's not terrible. It could have been worse. We got two god pallets out of the way. Could have been worse. But I should have 99'd her. That was my bad. I didn't mean to fully stalk her. Take another god pallet here as well. Looks like the ghost face MMR is very high, though. Thought he was going wide for a fast fall, but apparently not. Might have been better to try and stalk there, but we'll just take the M1. His movement wasn't too great anyway, so we should have quit down. Going up here, there's nothing to use up here, though. There's another gen down as well. This gen speed is crazy. My ghost face MMR must be, like, through the roof. Must be really high. I completely gave him that as well. I should have waited out. Claudette nearby for the flashlight save. All right, there's Joel on the gen, at least. We'll break this, and then we're going to try and bait the Claudette, because I know 100% she's nearby. Yeah, there she is. <laughs> oh, yeah, sprint burst. I forgot. Yeah, yeah, of course. So we did get the same Claudette from last game. That was definitely the same girl. She's still around, isn't she? She's up there. We can pick up. She's not making that. All right, let's do some stalk in here. Ninety-nine for later. Who revealed us that? How is she revealing us behind the, the wall, though? There you go. Gonna go up there. She has the window to work with if she makes it. Not gonna play window. Gonna go this side. Nothing over here to work with. Down she goes. No jolt value. Do you get a little bit of value with the add-on that we're using, though? Yeah, not really worth chasing. We'll just pick up other guys over there as well. How are they, like, so efficient on gens when they're, like, running around trying to get flashy saves? I don't understand that. Normally, when they're trying to get flashy saves, the gens don't get done. I guess they're not, like, overcommitting to it, though. Very tough games, though. Really high MMR on Ghostface, I would assume. Was that off the record? I'm not even sure that if this is the same Ada from last game or not. The Ada might be... It might be the Claudette and Ada was the same, so I think that was off the record. We are going to make that, though. The Claudette really messed up, though. We're going to... Oh, we can't... Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I should not have done that. 
Why did she not get the flashy save? I thought she would have got it. I had to pick up quick before she got to the pallet. But then I realized, obviously, she was still nearby with the flashlight. I don't know how she didn't get that save. She completely failed at that. What we're going to do, though, we're going to rekindle the totem over here. And then we're going to go straight back in for the Ada. Only bad, bad news is we have to hit her twice because of off the record. We're going to stealth and go back in. We need her out of the game. This is really tough. Did heal up straight away. Yeah, I don't even think... To be honest, I don't even... Oh, uh, yeah. It, pro it probably was worth stalking, actually. Perfect, perfect. Yeah, off the record. But that's better because now it's only two hits. Whereas with the heal, it would have been three hits. She has got the window over there. She is going to make it comfortably as well. Unfortunately for us. Ooh, window's not on this side. We made that. Bloodlust. Nice. Made it with Bloodlust there. Hopefully no Claudette. Claudette is nearby, but we are facing a rock, which is going to help us out. All right, GG's. Another good comeback there. I mean, we've not come back yet. There's still two gens left. They could still win this. Maybe not win it, but they could get two out at the very least. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to 99. I have not played too well today as Ghostface. I'm going to be honest. I've not played amazing. <laughs> I did try to 99 the Feng at the start. I also tried to 99 her. We're gonna, just going to have to break this. It's too good of a loop. We should be able to have her, though. There's not like a crazy amount of stuff over here to, to work with. Okay, we want the claw out. Good movement. Did pre-drop that. I was expecting to fake that. I don't know why. I was just I just had a feeling she was gonna try and fake it. So I was kinda ready for that. Alright, let's get her up. There's the What's that guy's name? Jeff, isn't it? <laughs> Wait, she's above us. <laughs> I think he's memeing around because of our, our cosmetic. <laughs> I think the survivors love this cosmetic. <laughs> you made friends, yeah, I guess. We're, we're about to lose them friends we, real fast, though. <laughs> Wait, she has lithe, right? Yeah, she does. Moving away, though. We made that right. No, we don't, do we? No, we do. Very close. That was very, very close. We got to give the Jeff Hutch at the end, haven't we? We got to give him Hutch. There's a sprint burst. Let's give the Jeff the Hutch. We made a friend, though. <laughs> resilient. That, that seemed very quick. Definitely resilience, though. All right, down she goes. Jolt value again as well. Alright, she's dead on the hook. Another successful comeback there. We've done really well. To, I mean, I feel like I've not even played that amazing. We we kind of messed up the stock a couple of times this game. But I mean, we've done well to come back though. One of one of these wants to die. Or one of these has to die. Who wants to die? One of them has to die. Who who should we kill, guys? Who should we kill and who should we give the hatch to? I we gotta give the hatch to the Jeff, right? We gotta give it to the Jeff. You wanna give it to the Feng? Nah, I think Jeff. I think Jeff. He's been... I don't know. He's been more of our friend than the than the Feng, I think. Jeff has been a little bit more... He's been memeing with us a little bit more than the Feng. Feng has a, a lot as well, though. Alright, you can have Hatch. Hatch is all yours, of course. Survivors love this cosmetic, though, don't they? They really do. Understandable as well. It is hilarious. You want me to kill both? You're, you're evil. You're really evil. You want me to kill both? <laughs> you can't kill them after they've been memeing around like this. Change my Steam name to what's up with the mask on. <laughs> That's a good idea. Oh, he wants me to serve him drinks. Okay. He wants me to serve him drinks. There you go. There's your drink. Alright, let's go find it. Alright, there we go. GG's. He got the hatch. Fun games as well. These were some fun games. <laughs> GG's.